Hi folks, Paul here. Just thought I would quickly show you the charging board that I made up for the community arts project I mentioned in my previous video. So it's a 24-way charger using the standard TP4056 modules. And the only real innovation that I've added to this one is I've got a voltmeter running on this last slot here. So when I'm plugging in a cell, if it doesn't start charging, I can check the voltage to see if it is zero volts, uh, because sometimes the, these modules won't charge something that's dead flat. Or well, the other problem is if they happen to be four point something volts, then these won't charge them. And it's useful to know whether they're um, fully charged and don't need charging or they might be super dead. I made them a PC module power supply which has 5 volts coming out to a XT60 and 12 volts coming out to uh, Anderson connectors. Uh, all right, let's turn that on, plug it in and they all light up, which is nice. Uh, this voltmeter here is the, one of the ones that has three wires going in, plus, uh, plus, minus, and the sensing wire. So that means I can run the voltmeter off the five volts and run the sensing wire from the battery um, so that this will measure all the way down to uh, effectively zero volts which is nice. So, uh, for example, that one there, 4.16. So if we throw it in a charger, it doesn't charge. And that's why, because it's already charged. Let's try another one. Oh, that's already charged as well, I think. Oh, there we go. Uh, I've got some doubles, throw those in. That looks good. That one is probably fully charged. I might plug that one way in down there. Uh, so I've got the power leads coming into the middle. To the middle I've got the positive 5 volts running under the battery holders on two of my nickel plated strapping lines which are soldered together here and then I've got two nickel plated strapping lines down here with a big stream of solder all the way joining them so theoretically the ones on the outside will get slightly less than 5 volts just because of the voltage drop but it shouldn't be too bad let's fill it up and see if if everything works yeah. That one. All right. I'm going to test them before I plug them in now. 3.5, that should work. Good. 3.4. Uh, 3.4. Good. Now we can get them somewhere. 3.7 3 4.5 4.1 will it will it charge? No, 4.1 doesn't charge. 2.3 either loose or it's actually fully charged already. 4.09, will that charge? No, nope. 4.09 is too high a voltage for these to charge.
Hmm. Four. Okay, I need to find some more cells, but uh, as you can see, it appears to be all working. Pretty good. Yep, that's all good. Uh, I'll find some more cells and carry on. Thanks for watching. Catch you later. Cheers.